Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Walkabout Mini Golf. Today as you can see again we're doing the labyrinth. This time we're doing the fox hunt. I'm going to be showing you where every clue is. So hopefully you can get the sweet putter that I have. Let's get it off. Your first hint is at the very beginning of the level. Before you take another step forward, heed my advice. Go back to your room, play with your toys and your costumes. Forget about the baby. Well, I guess we better do that. And in the crib, is your next clue. Ah, but you can't go home again, can you? Very well. Meet me at the place you met Hedgewort poisoning my sisters in the morning. A Hedgewort's right down here usually. On course two. You want to head over to where he usually stands? And the will be waiting. What do you think of my labyrinth? When you cross under the purple mask, turn left instead of right. Walk until you find a set of stairs. So right here is your purple mask. You want to go in. And instead of going down like you would play the course, you want to go left. You follow this for quite a while. I don't know how to speed up yet in editing, so this could be a minute. I'm just going to head right down to the side of the labyrinth. And you're going to find a set of stairs. At the top is your next clue. When you cross under the red mask, turn right instead of left. Look behind the red curtain. Do you want to head into overviewer mode? Well, that's what I call it. And on hole 9, there's a red mask right there. You want to go under it? Stairs. Through the curtain. To the left. And there's your next clue. Scour the bog of eternal stench. Don't fall in. It would be such a pity if you ruined your dress before the dance. So you want to head to the Bog of Eternal Stench, which is course 12. You don't have to go in, luckily. You want to pass over. Oh, I have to go in because I have a different mode set. Oh wait, you don't have to pass over. It's in the tree. <laughs> Forgot about that. You want to head right up to the... Which next clue? Six petrified men under the ground. One is missing more than just teeth. Now in hole number uh, six, you head down to the uh, Hall of Caves. There's one, two, three, four, five, there's six petrified men made out of stone. You want to head up the stairs, turn right at the one with the red glowing mouth, and the eye is next clue. The guard at the city gate failed me this morning, and now he's nothing but a broken suit of armor. Under his hollow helm, so the guard is at hold number 13, and right under his helmet, as he said, is the next clue. Look in the city under the massive peach, but don't dilly dally. Oh, don't dally with these revealers. I can't read. <laughs> YouTube's kind of new to me, so I can't talk perfectly. Uh, so you want to head right under the giant beach in the middle of the city. Sitting. Right. Let's see. Right up right next to the fountain. That's nice blue. You're running out. You're running out. There are so many clocks in my labyrinth. Which one won't tell time at night? There's a sundial on course 9. Right next to the handle, the next clue. Clever girl, but you're no match for me. Find five clues in the room where stairs go sideways. In that room will be hole number 17. There's Toby. So there's five peaches in here. The first, there's, I'm not going to put them in order. There are five. You want to head up the stairs? Here's your first one. Head over, and your next one's right. I can reach it. Yeah. Something's going on here. Kinda of hard to do the fox on the teleport mode off. You want to I have to turn that mode off. Hang on. Turn it off just for now, because I can move to it. Right there is your next clue. After that, there's one on top of this in front of us. That's three. And then there's one over here. Your next one should be, hang on, I don't remember where it was. It's been a while, so right there. I've re I've recorded time. I've, <laughs> I've reordered time. I've turned the world upside down, and I have done it all for you. Now give me this one thing, a dance. That would be hole number 18. You want to head up these stairs on the side. Actually, let me turn the setting back on so it doesn't look so weird for everybody. You want to head up these stairs, and at the very top, it's your next beach. 
Look what I'm offering you, your dreams. All I ask is that you sit with me atop my throne. Forever. Not long at all. Do that would be hole 16. And right up top of the Goblin King's throne is your next week. Forgot about the baby. And be my queen. Forget about the baby and be my queen. Don't walk out the doorway. Never leave. Do as I say, and I will be your slave. Well, let's just walk out the doorway. In this next speech. My kingdom as great. My throne, though humbler root and stone, is nothing, nothing less. My own. No, turn back to me. You'll never find another throne but mine in this kingdom. I splotched that up so bad. Well, the next uh, area where you could find your next clue would be whole time. If you go through the curtain, no, yeah, through the curtains, no, it's not whole time, where is it? Oh, uh, right here, no, it's right here. You want to go to hole four, teleport down, you want to head, after you come up the stairs from hole, you want to, or from hole four, you want to take a right, go down this hallway, another right, another right, and sitting on the throne is your last clue. You have no power over me. Congratulations, you have slab at the fox hunt. Defeated the Goblin King and won his special clawed putter. And I'm holding it right here. It's got the orb up top. Cool labyrinth design going down the side of it. Pretty awesome. Now, the next video that I will be uh, posting will be playing through this entire level to show you guys just how nice it is. Labyrinth at night is even really cool. I will see you guys in that video, which will be hopefully right up over here. And uh, until then, have a good one.